Hello YouTube fans, this is the Dusk uh, Clown. I want to talk about something that's been on my mind, obviously. So I've been doing enlightenment videos about this, but this is not really an enlightenment video on this channel, my main channel. I just want to talk about this. It's kind of unique, so I'm going to put my hood up. I just took a shower and got out, so my hair was wet. <laughs> so, moving on. Um, the sense of loving cartoons were not even that offensive to begin with. Okay. I hope you guys know that uh, shows, sorry if I'm mispronouncing it, but those shows are supposed to represent what um, our, rep our representations of what the cartoons are in the in the shorts, like the Looney Tunes shorts, the Riley, uh, Manly shorts, and the Looney Tunes, not Looney, I said the Looney Tunes, and the Disney shorts. Like Mickey Mouse is a brother, basically. You know, and this is coming from an Afro person, so I'm going to tell you this right now. There's no reason for you, white people, to get offended of these shorts. Because these shorts are showing you who you used to be, slaving people like me. Most people are like, yeah, but we know it's wrong and shit like that. You might think it's wrong. You might think it's wrong. Alright, but the elites of this world, or the, what do you want to say, the government of this world, they, they don't, they don't care. They still have that mindset. I hope you know that, right? The rich people of this world still have that mindset. I hope you know that. Nothing hasn't changed. Okay? For kind of all, let me give you a little history. In the 60s, we were trying to get rights. That was a fucked up thing that we did. We weren't supposed to get rights in the 60s. Alright? Like like so-called colored people so-called black people basically we were not supposed to do that we were not supposed to come together and hold arms like what Martin Luther King said right because let me point this out right now before I continue on with the Central 11 um China has made a China you can look this up because this is true I'm not lying China has made an, an artificial Sun a fake Sun why would some? Why would why would China make a fake sun if they're supposed if if they, if they are part of nature? If they're part of nature, they want to make a fake sun. That's how you know they're not part of nature. They just expose themselves. Anyone that's anyone that's like anyone that's China, Japanese, any any type of Caucasian, basically, is fucked. Okay, because you can't take the sun. That's why these Chinese people make the sun. For your, for your ass, for your Caucasian ass, because they can't take the sun that's up there, that's right, that's right here. Or oh, I can take it. You only can take it because <laughs> the atmosphere is cold. If it was, if it was extremely hot, you would die. But we'd be fine. So going back to the Sensor Eleven, the Sensor Eleven cartoons are not that nice. Sorry about that. All right, the Sensor Eleven. You might think some of the Sensor 11 stuff um, is bad, or some of the other stuff in the Sensor 11 is bad. The cartoon Sensor 11, right? Sorry, I'm just talking about because of that. But you guys might think that uh, one, you know, one is offensive than the other, right? Um, some of them might agree with, some of them might not, because again, going back, it's not all that offensive. It's just, guys, I want to tell you guys this. If these Looney Tunes shorts were movies or music videos showing you what was happening back in those times, you would have praised the fucking moon with it. But since it's animation and cartoons, you have a low expectations. You have low expectations for cartoons. You don't want cartoons to show you what's real. You don't want cartoons to show you like here's a here's a little short little animation about what happened during slavery. Oh, oh, but that's offensive. What? Well, because it came out in the 30s and 40s. That's a good documentary, right, to be honest, because it's showing you what kind of mindset they have, and also what kind of what what what, what we were dealing with at that time. But you guys want to forget about that history? Why? What's wrong with you? And going back to your Caucasians, your Caucasians should not, you white people should not be offended of, of any of these censored cartoons. None of you should. The fact that you all is fucking hilarious. You guys shouldn't. 
right? Kind of allowed your own kind make these shorts, right? Seriously. In the, what is it, in the Looney Tunes Golden Collection, they literally said that we had the freedom to create whatever we wanted. So don't tell me all oh, they, 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 they were locked hands or something like that. They couldn't have creative freedom to do stuff. No, they did. They did whatever the fuck they wanted to. Okay? They did. They did anything that they fucking wanted to. In that short of a, was it, cold black? You know, maybe the name is offensive, cold black, but she, doesn't she mention in the short that, oh, my hair is cold as black and my name is so white? Just so you know, the animation is sexy in that, in that short. And, and she looks sexy too, all right? <laughs> they made that animation look sexy, to be quite honest. And I can't be offended about that short. That short is, was around the time with the um, when we were heading to the world team and stuff. And um, let me talk about that too, because that goes to with all people too. Did you know that when World War II and World War I was happening, mostly World War II, some of our people wanted to join in the battle, right? With these top people in the government of the military, they didn't want us there. So guess what they did? They wanted to throw us like fucking wild bulls, basically. They wanted to throw us out in the fucking gutter to go to the, um, basically, they, they basically had plans for us to go to war while they stay behind while we're fighting. That's what they wanted to do. Obviously, that didn't happen. Or maybe they did. You know? History is, um... History just is told by the people that win. So, remember that, people. So, the Looney Tunes shorts, the Central Eleven, the... Uh, one of them... Like, uh, what is it? Going to Heaven on a Mule? That's not part of the Central 11, but I put it there. And if you want to see the whole Central 11 or the Central 12, I put the link in the description box for all of them. It's in daily motion if you want to watch them. So I'm going to put it there in the description box so you guys can watch them. And, and the thing is, I'm just... I even talked to my friend about this and he agreed. He agreed that... It, like these shorts these guys literally told you that these shorts were never for kids to begin with Looney Tunes Melly 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 I can't even pronounce that shit right um they were not supposed to be for children they never were and everyone knows Looney Tunes is not for kids so why are you guys are getting offended with certain stuff that are not supposed to be for kids you dumbass and there's also in um in the Golda collection, there's one episode. There's one episode of, of well actually two episodes. But one of the episodes I want to point out that what is it? That Bugs Bunny. Um just so you know, Bugs Bunny's brother because of the way he's dressed. The minstrel show. So you guys should know that, right? Um so when Bugs Bunny dresses as a brother, like when he does face and shit it's almost like contradicting himself because he's already a brother <laughs> you know it's stupid you know so that's what i'm saying man you guys gotta pay attention to this stuff but you guys don't because you guys just want to either you don't want to learn from your history and you don't want to know knowledge and stuff like that because look the reason i'm putting this out and saying that's not as, as offensive is because they actually representing you and um color people basically and they've always been doing that. And the stuff you see in cartoons, you know how Bugs Bunny does his thing and so does Daffy Duck and shit like that? Yeah, we could do that. Oh, how do you know? Guys, we lived in a time in the 1800s that was like, do you know anything about your history over the 1800s? No, you just not, you just know we're from the 1900s, right? Eh? That's why you need to go back. Search up Tartaria. They were literally giants around that time. The 1800s, and that's when the flood happened too. The reason I'm pointing this out because you guys gotta think, think, think. The history, of what they told you, is not true. All right. Seriously, we kind of allowed back in Tartaria, we had lights, like literally lights, lights that was shiny and shit like that. We kind of allowed there was a, an event that they made so people can get distracted. Well, they were bringing us down in low vibration, and they were trying to have a war and shit like that. That's what they do. 
And that's what they were trying to do now with this whole World War Three shit. The bullshit of World War Three. But, um... Another thing I want to point out too before I close this. The new Looting Tunes shows. Not the Looting Tunes show, but the new animation stuff. That's on HBO Max. Um... People are upset that the Looting Tunes... That, um, what is it? Elmo Fudd and Yosemite Sam are not having guns or something like that. They have knives now. And I want to say this. Warner Brothers, you're smart as fuck. Why? It's because they... You know how people are like, Oh, guns are bad. All right, let me use knives. That's way worse. You're going, you're going to have... You, Warner Brothers basically told the... the the, the cancer culture to f- go fuck themselves. And anyone that got offended of, oh, they censoring the guns is is stupid. You should laugh at that, them censoring the guns because one of us was like, oh, you're going to censor it? Okay, give them knives. And it was okay with the censors. The censors are stupid. They're fucking idiots. One of us just South Park them. They literally did. It's almost like when South Park was like, um, when they were, when they were making the title for the um, Bigger Longer Uncut movie, and they were like, um, well, hell breaks loose. And they were like, oh, you can't put hell in the title. I'm like, it's a rated off film. Oh, yeah, but it's animation and kids. And I'm like, it's not supposed to be for kids. So they made it up and saying that big and longer and uncut. And they liked it. Not thinking that it was a dick joke. And then they find out in the last minute. And they're like, oh, wait, well, you can't do that. And they're like, it's already too late. We printed all the posters already. <laughs> you know, shit like that, man. Like. So people that got offended with that shit are fucking stupid, retarded, don't know, don't know what the fuck they're talking about. What? <laughs> you censor the guns? All right, I'm going to bring out knives. Even better. Warner Brothers, you're a genius. <laughs> you're a fucking genius. Uh, seriously, man. You guys think guns are worse than knives? Have you ever watched The Dark Knight? Guns are too quick. You can't savor the little emotion. You know, so another part one part I want to mention about the Central Eleven. The um, what was it C- um, C- clear or C- clean um pasture or something like that? Now I admit the brother that's an angel talking lazy and all that. <laughs> that 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 is offensive. I will say that. I will say that it is fucked up. But o- overall, the show is great. That shirt is amazing. It literally is showing what so-called colored people are, angels. There's not one, even the same thing with um, going to heaven on a mule. There's not one, one, one white person in that shirt. Why? Why? There's a reason for that. They're telling you it. They're telling you who was, um, they're telling you who's the original people. They're telling you who are the angels. They're telling you. And all of you guys want to get offended about it and not seeing it through your third eye. And the thing is how um, going to heaven on a mule ends, a lot of people think that, oh, it's offensive that he throws the liquor and then runs away and grabs it. I think to me, uh, because, oh, he's a drunk and some shit. I didn't see it that way. You know what I saw? I saw a slave that threw his liquor bottle they didn't realize if his liquor bottle fell and it made a noise, his slave master would come over and whip him because he's not walking in the cotton field. So that's why he grabbed it. And that's how the short end. No one didn't like realize that and put that in their head. Oh, it's offensive because he's into liquor. You see how, you see how far you are dumb? You don't think. You just look at it and be like, yep, that's offensive. Because you want to be offended about everything. That's what's wrong with this generation. This generation just wants to be offended with everything and want and want certain people to take care of them. Instead of not looking at it or walking away like a fucking adult. You're not an adult, you're a child. If you want someone else to take care of your fucking shit because you get offended of shit, then you're a child. And you deserve to grow and you need to go back to fucking kindergarten. Because your parents didn't whip you hard enough. Seriously. And it's fucking sad that the world revolves around you now. Because because you are a small minority compared to a vast fucking universe. Literally. Seriously, man. So. I think that's really it, guys. 
Um, again, I'll put the, the sensor 12 in the description box. So, or the sensor 13. I didn't put the other shirt that was there about like another thing about Uncle Tom that was, that looked like it was a Wonder Bros shirt, but it's not. So, I didn't put it in that list because it's not, I'm talking about the Warner Brothers shorts. I'm not talking about any other shorts like Universal or Disney. I don't care about that. Oh, I care about the Warner Brothers ones. Why? Because the Warner Brothers ones are way interesting than the other ones. That's just me, man. That's just me. So I'll see you guys later. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And tell me what you guys think down below.